little dish and welcome if this is your first time joining the channel this is going to be the start of me unveiling my everyday style which is super exciting because I am thrilled to share all of this with you if you are a Bridgerton fan Gilded Age and just love all things French home interior design then you are in the right place because that is my everyday style and I kind of do a blend between French country and French provincial, the really elegant French Regency style that you see, but obviously all done on a budget. So I like to go to thrift stores, uh, just kind of going to estate sales or antique stores or just getting stuff handed down from family. <laughs> that's what i use to decorate and really just bring everything together to create this cozy french inspired parisian apartment and i'm just so excited because now that i'm taking down all my easter which i'm going to be sharing with you at least parts of that journey taking down easter and i'm decorating for spring and bringing out my florals and my natural style i'm just getting so thrilled to share all of this with you i'm almost feeling like myself again uh, just because it's been holiday after holiday after holiday so now it is time for my style to shine and I'm so excited so if you are just wanting to get some ideas some inspiration stick around also make sure you stay till the end because I'm gonna be doing a preview of what my bedroom is gonna be looking like I'm currently working on that right now so grab yourself a cafe au lait and join me as I decorate my home in these cozy yet elegant and timeless French inspired decor styles. Today we are starting off our decorating journey in my closet and taking down all of the Easter decor to refresh for spring. As I mentioned earlier, my style is a blend between French country, English cottage, shabby chic, Victorian, Regency, French provincial, and all of these will have a presence throughout my home. I know that there are a ton of different terms for these styles like coquette, Regency core, cottage core, so many others. So my style resembles those trends, but I'm gonna stick with classic definitions for simplicity's sake.
closet. I want to have it ultra girly with a touch of elegance so you'll see more of the French country Victorian elements incorporated into this style. To master these French and English inspired looks, be sure to incorporate a soft color palette. So think delicate shades of pink, blue, creams to evoke a sense of elegance to the space while maintaining a warm and inviting atmosphere. Another biggie in order to get this style right is to really focus on vintage elements and incorporating those throughout. So what I mean by that is any of those cute little tchotchkes that you see when you're shopping and thrifting, little vintage statues of uh, women or of just sceneries or there's old paintings that you can get. You'll see these marble statues. My grandparents got those in Italy. So there's just an eclectic mix of all kinds of different little things throughout my decor and they're all from a whole bunch of different places. So that just makes the whole vibe really fun and gives a lot of character to the space.
You want to play with textures here too, so that's why I kind of did the fluffy fun boa right in that main center stage area, but then I also have the pink tool to kind of cast that magical whimsy glow behind all of my little ceramics and fun things and pieces that I have out. And also I have just a, a delicate fringe scarf that my mom gave me and I just use that as the tablecloth on the little table by the door right there. And since this is just my closet today, I don't have a whole lot of room to play with a bunch of textures. So that will be showcased in future videos when I'm decorating the other rooms in my home. So make sure that you subscribe and stay tuned so that you can tune into those as soon as they come out. This one is huge. Add romantic details throughout your space. Embrace romantic touches to evoke the charm of French design. Incorporate floral patterns, delicate trims, like lace, anything lace, and gilded accents to infuse your space with an unmistakable sense of romance and sophistication. So that was really what I was focusing on here for my closet. I love just that romantic element of these themes and I really wanted to enhance that here. And by incorporating these tips into your decor, like the different textiles, the vintage elements and pieces, the florals, the oil paintings, just all of that goodness. Once you do all that, you're just really gonna be introducing that, that timeless charm and that create that French inspired sanctuary that exudes elegance. With each vintage find and charming detail that I'm adding here, my closet is gradually transforming into the French inspired sanctuary that I've envisioned. And remember too that the key is to balance elegance with coziness, creating a space that feels both luxurious and inviting. So if this is a look that you are inspired by and really want to use on your own, then make sure to really have that balance. And I think those vintage finds and thrifting, which is why I'm going to be doing a whole bunch more thrifting videos because I find so many things that are perfect for these themes. But thrifting really gives you that ability to balance these two styles and really have things be elegant, luxurious, cozy, and you don't know how much someone spent on something because it could be anything at a thrift store. So that is really a special piece of how to decorate in these styles is thrifting. So don't be surprised to see a whole bunch more of thrifting videos and I'm sure that this closet is going to look different once I find more things and add them. So this there's always going to be new fun things to be inspired by on this channel. Introduce the timeless charm of florals into your French inspired decor by incorporating faux floral arrangements, arranging delicate blooms in vintage inspired vases or pitchers, really add a touch of natural beauty and freshness to the space. And I think that that elevates it and, and really 
makes it extra cozy and gives it that cottage effect along with the elegant French provincial Regency look. And I even wanted to kind of take it a step further in my closet, so I created a vintage floral gallery wall. And I just think that this is just so cute and it really makes me just feel calm and collected and cozy and elegant as I'm getting ready in my closet every morning. So just hang a collection of quaint frames, all different styles too. That is really key with this with this look, especially the cottage look. So just pick different frames, have different kind of motifs and colors and different things kind of going with it, but I'll kind of make sure that they all go with the same theme. So I did all florals and this really just gave the closet an old world charm effect and just really added depth and character to the space while also evoking the ambiance of a quaint countryside cottage.
you all think. I hope that you all loved the first taste of my French inspired apartment <laughs> and me decorating it in that style. So it, there's gonna be lots more coming your way, a lot more videos. I got my bedroom coming up. I have, I'm gonna be doing a French cottage, English cottage living room. I'm gonna be doing cottage core kitchen. There's a whole bunch of fun things coming in spring and I'm just so thrilled to share all this with you. So I hope you enjoyed the tips. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below and I am excited for you to join me on my next decorating journey already. <laughs> Stay lovely, my friends.